Hello, hello, hello. How are you guys doing? Thank you guys so much for joining me. I appreciate you guys so much for clicking on my video. This will be for my Gemini Sun, Moon, and Rising. Keep in mind, this is not going to resonate with everyone, okay? So, take the part that does or what doesn't, leave that shit on out. Now, keep in mind, you're going to hear my kids in the background as well, okay? So, I'm going to be in and out, but I'll be back focused. Anyway, so, let's go ahead, Gemini. I'm getting that as I was pre-shuffling and meditating. Some of you definitely could be moving away from a Virgo, and a Virgo could be worried about you, mad at the fact that you're moving on. And I'm also getting that some of you could be going towards maybe a fire sign. Somebody could be obsessed with a fire sign, uh, or a fire sign could be obsessed with you. Um, but I'm definitely seeing somebody want to give it to a fire sign, and it could be a moving away from a Virgo, okay? Or somebody could have this this uh, this fire and this earth in the chart, okay? All right, let's see what's going on, Gemini. Let's see what's going on, Gemini. Yeah, somebody's definitely taking an action to do something here. All right, maybe reach out, maybe communicate, okay? All right, because somebody feels regret about something. We got the Five of Cups and the Five of Pentacles, five, five. So somebody feels regretful here. They want, they're, my, I did see the Wheel of Fortune. All right, so there might be a change, but definitely I'm seeing someone wanting to communicate towards somebody, wanting to speak out, reach out, what have you, because they feel regret about something. Maybe because somebody had a whole bunch of options. I'm getting about maybe five. Okay, two of them maybe left this person injured or what have you, um, stuck, what have you, something. Somebody lost something and something like they in poverty, no money, something in a situation. And with the five of pentacles, if somebody wants something to change, it has to do with the marriage or commitment contract here. All right, let's see. We have here the world, okay. So something definitely has came to an end or will be coming to an end. A cycle is definitely closing out. All right. Ooh, that's to me. Let's see. We have here the high priestess. So somebody could be closing out a situation maybe with a mistress. Okay. Or a spiritual guru. Let's see. Or somebody that's very spiritual. Uh, the initials B and J could be significant. Yeah. Yep. So somebody's completing a situation. Somebody's definitely leaving a karmic or a mistress behind. Okay. Somebody that was trying to keep a secret here. Yep. And somebody's moving forward with the chariot, maybe with the cancer. We got the ace of cups, maybe towards new love. Okay, y'all. I got y'all. I'm coming with this, the messages. All right, my nose get the itch and I be knowing they are around, honey. Speaking through them. Well, they're using me to speak. <laughs> Hold on, Momo. Okay. Uh, change your shoes. Okay, we have here the uh, page of swords. So we have somebody watching somebody now. Somebody want to go towards maybe a water sign. Mm, maybe a Leo. Somebody could be watching a Leo, okay? This person could be very beautiful. This person could be uh, in their childlike energy here, okay? And, um, yeah, yeah. This is the truth. This is the truth. This is the truth with the Ace of Swords. But we have a Ten of Pentacles. Maybe this person is established. Maybe this person is very wise. A lot of people look up to this person, but this person is very established, very wise. There go the fire sign at the end of the deck. Hold on. Okay. Definitely. That is the truth. So somebody could be watching somebody. Okay, we have the Knight of Pentacles with the Lovers and the Six of Swords here. So somebody's choosing, Gemini, this could be you. You choosing to move on. Okay? Take your time. Bait. Okay? You manifested something here. It's something that you know that you particularly want, Gemini. You want something here. You definitely want something. You know what you want, and you're going to get it. You're taking that action. Yeah. All right? You're going yeah. you gonna to reach out and say, look at this. It's going to be a lot of fighting and arguing. And uh, it's going to be some fight behind this. So be prepared. Okay? Um, so we have here the Queen of Swords, and we have here the Two of Wands. So, what I'm getting here is somebody could have been trying to plan out their future with the someone, and this Queen of Wands, excuse me, Queen of Swords was trying to block it out, what have you, but or somebody's gonna block somebody coming forward. It could be you, Gemini. Okay, we got the Two of Swords because somebody's stuck here. So we have here the Knight of Cups, oh, excuse me, the King of Cups, so Water Sign, Kids by Scorpio. So somebody could be reuniting maybe with the uh, Water Sign, Masculine Water Sign. They're going to uh, try to invest with that person. Then we have here the Stretch card, maybe a Leo, that, a Fire Sign again. We got the Seven of Swords and the Nine of Wands. So somebody could be doing this in secret. 
maybe investing with the water sign, but keeping it a secret and not a wand blocking something else out here. We have here the hangman, somebody stuck. Then we have here the eight of cups and the ten of wands. So somebody walked away. They already let down a burden due to some type of confusion or option. Fear point blank, okay? So I'm getting somebody want to go towards somebody and leave somebody else because they know for a fact they don't want to be with them. Then they might want to go towards maybe a fire sign here. But this fire sign might be in a situation, okay, already. Let me let me clarify. They got a fire sign. Dang us. All of it through the free. Let me see. What's the seven of swords? Seven of swords? Seven of swords? What is the seven of swords? So we have here the three of pentacles and the page of wands. Yeah, somebody doing it in a secret. Somebody reuniting or um in a relationship maybe with a king of cups. Turns of Pisces or Scorpio. And they're doing this in secret. They're investing with them. They're working it out with that person. They have romantic feelings for that person. Vice versa. Okay? Yeah, somebody's investing and fighting for something here. And somebody else is heartbroken. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Higher font. Somebody could even be married. Let's see what else. I wanted to come out, but there we go. What is that? The okay, the three of wands. Okay, waiting, planning out, what have you. Okay, we got the moon. So somebody could be fearing this. So that's why they're planning it out because they're afraid somebody's going to reject their offer. Or you could or they could. Yeah, because somebody's already heartbroken. They're in a state of panic. We have the judgment to the two of cups. So they're already, see, mm, judgment to the two of cups. Judgment to the two of cups. Okay, so somebody might reject this offer. Or this queen of wands might reject an offer. Okay. Hermit is going to have somebody do some type of self-reflection. The Magician. The Devil. Ooh. They're going to black magic again. See, somebody's trying to break up somebody's home because somebody was with somebody that they don't longer want it. And they want to go towards someone else, but that person could be already in a relationship. And somebody else in the background wants that person that that person is with or you're with or what have you. And they're trying to create some type of black magic and then break up this damn union. Okay? Ooh. Get your ass on. You got to go to black magic just to... If this person don't want your ass, like, what the... Mm. If, ooh. Ooh. Oof. I'll be trying to mess up my car so if that devil is... If somebody was juggling, exactly, your ass was juggling. If you couldn't decide what you wanted before, what makes you think that you could come get it back when you want to get it back and that person's already moved on? Let that person live their damn life. I'm getting a headache D uh, getting in this energy here. Somebody could have um, been with a Virgo here and there's no longer a commitment with that situation. And they got somebody mad. King of Swords, okay? Maybe you decided not to go along with this damn Virgo and this person is mad as hell. And this person could be doing black magic or what have you. Got the ten of swords. Yeah, somebody mad due to some type of options. Due to somebody choosing something else here. All right. So we got the sash. We got the knight of swords. So somebody rushing in because they want to mend things, balance things out. You know, start a new leaf. Okay. And this could be that uh the queen of pentacles or vice versa. But no, somebody's receiving their justice, their karma, as in a beautiful freaking marriage. Okay, you're gonna hear about it. Somebody reach out, you're gonna hear that. No, I'm in a relationship. Somebody's in a relationship and they're happy. Who had this? Scorpio head energy. Knight of Cups. Uh -huh. The Fool. King of Pentacles. Style. So somebody's offering somebody something. Period. Six of Wands. Like they already know where they want to be. They know where they want to be. It's as simple as that. Oh, wow. Somebody know where they want to be, Gemini. You know where you want to be, or this person knows where they want to be. Is it that is it you, what have you? But somebody know where they want to be. But I really feel that somebody else has been, it's like it's too little too late. Too little too late for you to come back. Who, who said that? Um, JoJo? It's a little too late. Some, 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 some. Just kind of, you know what I'm saying. All right. Let's see, Gemini. Let's see what's going on in love. Stay optimistic. So I'm trying to stay positive about your love life. Okay? 
if somebody's gonna make the effort here, okay? Then we have heart to heart conversation to free yourself. See, when somebody reaches out to somebody, somebody's gonna figure out that you're in a loving relationship or somebody else is in a loving relationship, okay? Somebody's gonna be real and let them know. And somebody has no other choice but to free themselves. Then we have to let go of control issues. It's safe for you to love. Exactly. Somebody needs to let go of control issues. You have romantic feelings and healing issues and separation. See? Whoever separated from somebody that somebody really, really wants, okay? It's like they, they want to they wanna mill, you know, mend things with you, okay? They want this, this relationship back. They want to marry you. And somebody already is in a marriage, period. Dang. Like that's cutthroat to the point. Somebody's in a relationship. It could be four people involved, two males, two females, uh, two people, a male and a female is going through it. And that male wants to go towards this female with her other man, but that female's in a happy relationship. So now this person that wants to leave could be stuck. I don't know. You got to put it where it fits, okay? Pair point blank. That's what I got for you guys. Gemini, they're going to be mad when they reach out to you. You tell them they do with somebody else, boo. Okay, but anyway, let them be mad. Y'all got it. All right, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you guys so much. Bye.